Hello everyone, uh, I haven't uh, published videos in the past few weeks and uh, many questions raised in this time period. I will respond to all of questions regularly uh, starting today. And if you have any questions, reach me at this email. To... Uh, the most frequently asked question uh, by, uh, by many uh, audiences was uh, please make video how to make or prepare physiographic map okay so I come up with today I come up with uh, uh, this issue and how to prepare physiographic map using uh, digital elevation model and couple of softwares okay so we will see today Big map is a type of map that shows uh, physical characteristics or features and sometimes elevation of uh, a particular area or region in two-dimensional format and uh, there are many ways of making physiographic map in this video we will use digital elevation model and a couple of softwares to prepare it uh, those softwares are uh, global mapper and surfer the first step is go to Go to global mapper and uh, open it i have already opened global mapper here and you can add your digital elevation model by going to file and open file open data files or directly open data file here and uh, go to the folder where you have saved your digital elevation digital elevation elevation model or then so I think this is my digital elevation model okay say yes to all and okay yes this is my dem data and uh, the what we want to do in global mapper is exporting uh, digital elevation model in grid format okay because the server software accepts uh, uh, gridded format that is in ASCII format, ASC dot format. So uh, we can export this elevation model by going to find and export, export elevation as grid format. Okay, it is in ASCII grid format. You, there are a number of formats here and uh, the format that is very compatible with surfer is ASCII grid format okay say it okay and uh, here is vertical units meter okay my elevation model is in meter so I will leave it and sampling space okay uh, it will take a sample from 31 31 meters okay you can change this one if your area is very rigid and uh, uh, you can make it around 90 or 300 but I leave it as default then you can give name team created uh, data okay you can select it and save it in that format yes it is saving it then uh, go to surfer ah, this is what we have made before and then I will delete it okay so this is the interface you get when you open surfer so go to 3d surface okay after opening surfer go to 3d surface surface and add a dim that is in a grid format exported from uh, from global map okay so here is my grid format dim I will import it yes so here is my physiographic map you can rescale it okay by stretching Up or 
less hair uh, it will fit and uh, fit the window you can say like that and click on on the map and here are here are some of table of contents to edit it here you can edit color okay let me use this one okay it's not good rainbow I think this one is uh, nice I will leave it okay if in, in case if you do not find this table of content uh, let's say here I have removed it and you cannot get this yeah, the information the table of content that gives you information about your your map go to view and click properties okay check this one it will come yes then uh, what we have to do then is a color scale okay we, we can add legend here yes here is legend you can drag it and put inside map okay and click on the scale and you can change the interval okay and let me say 300 okay i'll make it 300 or i think 200 is enough yes okay and then uh, if we want to add the base okay you see the base for for this map check show base button here and you can change the color there is a uh, okay you can uh, change the color from here I will leave it as default uh, what's remaining is uh, I think we have to add uh, some of map elements okay a scale and North Zahra okay how can we add we how can we add it Okay, so go to map tools, scale, okay, yes, it is around here, okay, so you can drag, it's in meters, okay, we inform that it is in meters, Cycle space in. Uh, okay, we can change it in it, its its height in inch. Okay, single bar alternate. We can change it single bar and field. Yes, this one is looking good. Let me check another. Mm -hmm. Not good. The first one is better. And. Uh, Okay, levels, level of work. Yes, it's very good. Uh, Still, for units is a noun here, but it is in meters. So we can add a meter ladder. And uh, what we have to add is another one is you can really rescale this one, okay? You can rescale it. Another one is uh, you saw you, you, you see this one is y, y axis, okay? It is in UTM format, okay? This one is y axis and x axis. This one is uh, latitude and this one is longitude so our arrow should come perpendicular parallel to y axis okay so how can i add my north arrow click here point come here and i'm sorry so
double click on the point and come to symbol edit the symbol and here I will get northern row you can select here let me take this one and increase the size but my north direction is not like this so I have to make parallel to y axis wait my y axis is here, not this one so let's rotate it okay I can rotate it around I think one negative 90 no around somewhat uh, 80 degree Oh, we can, we can use this one, I think. How can we rotate? Ah, this is not good. Let me rotate it by using free rotate. Okay, I think. Yes, now it's parallel to my Y axis. I will deselect, reload Yes. Yeah, so we have done our. What we need is uh, we can add text here. Okay. Metas. Where is it? Metas. about preparing a physiographic map so you can export it okay you can get export export here and in jpg format so physiographic map so okay so hide this one and fix the resolution make it 600 So uh, it's exporting. So this is about how to prepare physiographic map. If you have any question, comment, type comment in the comment section. Thanks so much. See you.